Good morning, Arthur. Anyone wants to play dominoes? Yeah, I think I have time. What are you doing? What's it look like I'm doing? It looks like you're. So where did you learn to play? Saloons, dives growing up. By eight, I was playing piano every night in a cat house. <laughs> really? It weren't no life for a child, but I learned a few things in the why. You're very purdy. I'm sorry, I'm not being forward or nothing, but you are. You're very sweet. Yep. Tak, tak, Mr. Robe. No, przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, uh, good I'll for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. Do you borrow from a German man? Aha, uh, German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the Kaiserreich. I don't ja? speak German neither. I'm here for money, money that you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Leopold Strauss. Uh huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, oh no, no, yeah, yeah. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver. Potrzebuję trochę czasu, znajdę ci pieniądze. No, still don't understand you. Where is the money? Gold, dollars. Nie rób tego. I have nothing. Nie, nie. No, 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 no. Please, no. Money, but but I have this. It's, it's good. It's good. It's valuable. It's it's Warsaw, Yes. I have your things. Okay. I have anything in here or out there. Yes. Don't even speak English. You must have come here with something. Yeah. 
gonna be something somewhere. No, 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 no. Yes, 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 yes. I need, I must eat, Prosho. Okay, that should about cover things.
You're all right, girl. Yeah. Wait. Yep. Let's go, girl. Matthews. Oh, no, no, not me, sir. Uh-uh, that's the greenhorn over there. Oh, and there he goes. <laughs> Damn it! Hey, get back here! You owe us money! Yeah.
always got to be such a goddamn performance with you. Now, I told you I'd get you the money next week, and I'll get it. If you didn't make it this week, who's to say you'll make it next? Don't you take that tone with me. I thought you said you loved I me. I do. I do. But what I get paid ain't enough for one person, let alone two. Your money's got to be your problem now. The only problem I got is this bleating going on in my ear. Lily, where's our money? What? That loan you took. It's payday. I'm sorry. I don't have it right now. Well, then. I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper, give him what you've got. I ain't giving him nothing except a lesson in damn murder. Son of a bitch. Uh, 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 It's a debt. Oh, damn it. Can a man have some peace? Yep.
Good evening, mister. Will you quit with that damn There a Mexican reason you're daughter? staring at me? This your first time here? Well, welcome to my store. That's a good choice. High quality. collapsed. I, I, I don't know why. It's my friends. Uh, my legs all numb. Please hurry. Uh, well, this don't look good for you. Uh, please, just uh, help me, mister. Uh, I'm trapped oh. here. Aren't you helping? I'll see what I can do. Oh. Yes, yes, just lift as hard as you can. Oh, thank you. Thank you, you saved sure. me. Oh, that was bad. Okay. Sure. Uh, I could have been stuck here and starved or eaten. Oh, you poor, dumb animal. Oh. What'll I tell Mildred? Well, thank you. It's selfish of me to ask, I know, but would you mind taking me home? Not sure if my leg will get me there. Sure. Be happy to. Really? Thank you so much. Do you know Valentine? I live there. No problem.
normally travel this far alone, you know. I was off inquiring about a possible new line. Slow down, please. See, my husband... Well, it's just me and my boy now, and it's hard to find work. Hmm, I'm sure it is. A good opportunity. That's what I'm looking for. Not much work for a woman with a boy to raise. I won't work in no saloon, but I've got sharp eyes and quick hands. Yeah. I was hoping to get a job working as a seamstress. A wealthy man said he'd pay me for the work. Sounds promising. Also doesn't sound real. Oh, you may be right, I suppose. He said he'd provide room and board for me and for my child. He wanted to meet me first. I'd be careful with offers like that, ma'am. I can't afford to dismiss offers like these, even if they do seem... odd. Yeah. Well, just be careful is all I'm saying. I may not have another opportunity like this. Now I'll have to pay Mildred back for her horse. It sure sounds like you're in a hard position. You finding me is the only good thing that's happened to me in a long while, sir. We're close now. Just a little further. We're here. Thank you for all your help. You're a good man. Glad I was able to help. You take care. Appreciate it. You be well. Dumbass. Look who's back. Yep. Hey, get that horse out of here. Relax. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Matthews gave me a message for you. He said when it was convenient to head into Emerald Ranch. He's looking at a few business things there. Okay. Oh, he'll find something, too. He always does. Will you be well now, Mr. Morgan? I'm always well, Miss Grimshaw. He used to rape her. After she was set free at the end of the war, he tried it again. And she killed him with a knife.
traps. No. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Fine. Our accounts are up to date. Sad sacks, a lot of them. Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. Hello again. Well, I'm glad you're doing the right thing. I'll ring up West Elizabeth and give him the news. Clear this ride up for you. Thanks, mister. Help! 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 You better shut up that pretty mouth. Stay back. is wrong with you? Should have moved. Play! No!
Son of a bitch. Misty? Sorry, girl. You idiot. Yeah. Here I took a little jolt and have managed to get myself hopelessly lost. I am staying in Strawberry. If you could just guide me back. Can't think of a good reason to say no. Oh, thank you, thank you, sir. Well, after you, what possessed me to come out here, I'll never know. <laughs> What are you doing out here, anyway? It clearly ain't your natural habitat. I don't know. I'm just visiting. I, I'm from New York City, actually. Hello, sir. I've, uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the trail of a dangerous gang. Como Driscoll. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got in a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mick, so maybe them's your boys. You can look right enough when we hang them. Thank you, Sheriff. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> you gonna get me out of here? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh, I ain't joking, cowpoke. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months, and now I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. Well, you gotta do something. Why? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people wanting to see you swing. You got to do something, Arthur. 
got any dynamite? Maybe that steam donkey over there still works. Done here, just get the hell out. I'm gonna give you one more chance to get some Tell you later. Come on. The hell is wrong with you? Follow me, Arthur. Yeah. 
had something of mine. My guns. I showed him. And I'll show the rest of this town! You have really lost it this time. I care about more than those guns. That much is clear. Who was that fella? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't end well. I saw how it goddamn ended. He was gonna let me hang. I'm starting to wish I had. And you owe Lenny, too. If he hadn't found us in time... Yes, you will all be thanked profusely. I promise. Yeah. Uh, Got your back for some unknown reason. Ha! Watch it. I think we finally lost. Well, I hope so. I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. And thank you. There I was having a dull day only for you. To liven it up by letting me help you shoot up <laughs> half a town. You're a funny fella, Arthur. Real funny. Why you act all sour all the yeah, time? Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court jester? All right, listen. I'm sorry, but we're family now. Arthur, you and me. Sons of Dutch. Makes us brothers. Sometimes, brothers make mistakes. I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back a strawberry. Come see me. Maybe I can make things up to you. You ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offering. <clears throat> Bye now. Yeah! <laughs> 